Daniel, good evening. Good evening, Russ. Just a short time ago, NASA rolled back the protective gantry, revealing Atlantis poised and ready for launch tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern time. And with just a handful of shuttle launches left, this is NASA's last chance to repair and upgrade the Hubble in the hopes it will continue to educate and inspire. And lift off of the Space Shuttle Discovery with the Hubble Space Telescope, our window on the universe. Launched in 1990 amid great fanfare, Hubble was designed to examine the deepest recesses of space, probing the origins of the universe. But a disastrous manufacturing flaw hobbled the Hubble's ability to focus, and it became a public relations nightmare. NASA says the trouble with Hubble is a tangled antenna. In 1993, an unprecedented repair mission set out to rescue the telescope. We have a goal for relief. And NASA's reputation future of the agency, the future of our space program hung in the balance on the ability of a team of seven astronauts, men and women, to ride to the rescue of Hubble to repair and restore the vision. It worked, and NASA's been delivering groundbreaking science and amazing imagery ever since. I mean, it went from being perhaps NASA's greatest embarrassment when they launched it with a mirror that was improperly ground. Uh, to perhaps its second greatest success, and I'm saying second only in relation to the Apollo moon landings. This fifth and final repair mission is extremely tricky. Astronauts will make five lengthy and complex spacewalks, adding a new camera and installing more powerful batteries. The clock is ticking from the moment we launch, and we have to try and get everything done. So there's a lot of pressure to get out the door on time, to start the spacewalks. There's not much time to mess around. Hubble's orbit creates a higher risk of collision with space debris. That orbit also makes the International Space Station unavailable as a safe haven. So a backup shuttle, Endeavour, sits on the launch pad, ready for possible rescue. And has this ever happened before? NASA's never prepared a second shuttle for rescue duty. This is unprecedented in that sense. The upgrade, if successful, could extend Hubble by five to seven years, giving Hubble huggers plenty more eye-popping imagery. You know, I think that scientific exploration, human exploration of space, is absolutely the, you know, the most important thing uh, for certainly my life, but also for people to do. And so in that sense, it's worth taking a great risk. This dramatic Hubble mission comes as the shuttle program is winding down. There are only nine shuttle missions left. But there are many questions about the future of manned spaceflight. Just last week, President Obama ordered a major budget review from NASA. Russ? Okay, Daniel Seberg in Florida. Thank you very much.